Hi everyone, we are Monster Party. I'm Volcano Max. And I'm Bass. And today we are playing Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, aka Revenge of the Not Real Word. Uh, Bass <laughs> will be playing, uh, and I will be offering witty insights that are often wittier in my head than they will be out loud. And I am the Lord of the Dance! We're no, not playing not. the tutorial. We're not playing the tutorial. Yeah, fuck the tutorial. Fucking, it's hot, tight. We know how to play already. Cutscenes. Oh man, look at those palm trees. Clearly, we are in one of the nicer parts of Africa. <laughs> I couldn't tell is, by the giant buildings. Which is about five square miles of Africa. We've yeah. <laughs> come so far in just three short years. And here we have desert. Nelson Mandela. No. No. The early years. <laughs> no, really. This is the future, bro. Okay, fine. It's a clone of Nelson Mandela. There you the go. There years. you go. You happy? That actually fits Metal Gear Solid pretty yeah. well too. He's the only person they'll let lead Africa in this uh, in this dark dystopian future. <laughs> and the guy who adjusts his glasses without actually having that, to adjust. And them. that's just Carlton. Mr. Just Carlton. Yes. <laughs> And Mr. here we have a uh, Metal Gear Solid 2 protagonist that nobody liked. Hey, I liked him. I he, liked had a nice, too. he had a nice butt. That's not why I liked him. I always thought he was underrated. And the fact that he's voiced by Quinn Flynn doesn't hurt anything. Yeah. Uh, I, for those of you who don't really follow voice actors, you probably know Quentin Flynn best as playing Reno in the uh, Final Fantasy VII stuff or Axel in Kingdom Hearts. He also voices Ryan. Yes, well, the security. All right, so yeah, things. very African motorcade going on here. Well, Lots basically, so, so basically, what's happening is saying, like war. It. War never changes. One sword keeps another. I I play a Metal Gear Fallout crossover. Sometimes that'd be kind of tits, actually. Alone. Yeah, I'd with like that. cyborgs and clones Sometimes and Metal Gears and shit. Oh my god, and, and dude, that'd be perfect. Better stealth mechanics. Oh my god, that'd be perfect. Better self mechanics than the Fallout. Better better self -mechanics. That's like the perfect mix. Of, like, hmm. like it's if you mixed Metal Gear with Mario, it would just wouldn't work. <laughs> it's like, tell that to Smash Bros. I could, say the same I could see like Snake like picking up coins and be like, what's this? Metal Gear. <laughs> Metal coin. Metal coin. <laughs> what is happening? Princess. Oh no! Just, shit's happening. She's going down. Time to get hot. And. Badass motherfucker. A Brazilian! Oh no! He's got some hips on him. That's he how you does. know he's Brazilian. <laughs> because of the hips? Because of that, because of that booty. Not, not the Brazilian accent. That's not what gives it away. <laughs> it's the booty, man. <laughs> it's the booty. That Brazilian dude booty. And yeah, this is Jetstream Sam, and he is the best character in Metal Gear history. Straight up. I want to know more about him, but like they, they keep him so mysterious. Well, fun fact, there's actually a DLC all about him. Oh, seriously? Yeah, once you beat the game, you'll be able to play uh, there's a Jetstream Sam DLC and a Blade Wolf DLC. Oh, sick. Where you get to play as uh, res the respective characters. Well, I get to play them. I'm going to play them the fuck out of them. Yeah, we will, we will be doing that DLC once we finish the main game, because it's awesome as hell and worth showing off. <laughs> Or at least the Jetstream Sam DLC is. I don't know much about the Blade Wolf DLC. I love his grin. Yeah. He's so goofy. He gives what no fucks. He knows he doesn't have to. We got hit, sir. Uh, that's Boris. He's awesome in Russia. That's really all you need to know about him. Uh, that there is Courtney. She's the safe bitch. And her eyes are kind of freaky, actually. Yeah. I never noticed that before, but like, wow. She, she is honestly one of the most boring safe bitches in, in the Metal Gear series. I, I hate to say it. But she does show the necessary amount of cleavage as required by Japanese law. <laughs> and so we've got token called Cyborg driving the limo here. But, I mean, it's really hard to call him token. I mean, everything's token there, isn't it? Ryden's just running away like a bitch. Come on, man. He's not running like a bitch. He's gonna take some motherfuckers on. Guard the Prime Minister. Guard the Prime Minister. Here's my cool sunglass whisk-off thing. 
I love how he, he just wh whips it off and he's the like... Code. That's about as Japanese as you can get. Yeah. <laughs> that code throw there. My favorite part of this ensemble, though, the high heels. Yes, the pumps. So yes. sexy. He can slash up these fuckers and look good doing it. He's got those child-bearing hips, you know? He needs to show them <laughs> off. Isn't he Siberian? No, Liberian. Oh, Liberian. But he's also really more American. Well, he's, he, but, was, he was like raised in America, right? He had dual. He has dual citizenship, I think. Wow, we're going into the citizenship <laughs> history of a fictional. Well, I character. just remember. I remember because Metal Gear Solid Two, um, they were they really got into the whole like he has a wife and kid and stuff. Well, he has a wife and kid now. He didn't do Metal Gear Solid Two. No, he did. No, he didn't. Remember at the very end, he like met with his wife. That was the future. He was meeting with Rose in the future. Oh. Or something. I don't remember exactly. Metal Gear Solid 2 was fucking weird. I love how he puts it in his, in his pumps. The sword in his pumps. Yeah, I mean, that's what the pumps are for. Well, well that, that's their secondary function. Primary function? Showing off the child there again. Secondary function? Yeah, where are we going? Swords. Where do we go? Oh, yeah. You, it's I can pretty run linear, bro. You're not playing Legend of Zelda here. <laughs> really only one direction you can go in. Alright, where we go? And hey, what's up? There's people here. That means I'm yes, going the right no. way. If there's stuff to kill, that means you're going the right way. That's how it works. Whee! Alright. So, yeah, I know you're, I know you're rising. Yeah, unlike its predecessor, it is very hack and slash. Uh, there are stealth elements, but they're pretty basic and ignorable most of the time. And you want to ignore them because the combat's really fun and. Yeah. Sneaking around, kind of lame. Right. Now, this you game is made by Platinum. Uh, stuff like... Uh, you can do this. Watch out! Alright, I don't have the Zan time yet. No, you don't get that until Chapter 1. I'll uh, get into that. You can show off Blade Mode, and I think you should show off Blade Mode. Yeah, I'll do it. Da, 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 this da, da, is Blade da, da. Mode. You just fucking swing your sword around like a madman and chop shit up. It's pretty great. Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out. Also, kind of one of the that was one of the main uh, things they were showing off when they the were marketing, still, yeah, yeah. Like I remember when they first announced this game back when it was still called Metal Gear Solid Rising and still being made by Konami. Yeah, and they just had a bunch of videos of Raiden slicing the crap out of the water. It was pretty great. Yeah, you just they just had them, like cutting stuff up and like it was like here I'll show yeah. you on this fence. Watch this. If you can't come through the barricade, try to fence. Whee! <laughs> go into blade mode, go into blade mode. Oh, oh, well, oh, oh. Oh, it's too late now. Never mind. Yeah, you can go into blade mode and just slice the crap out yeah. of Yeah, oh, I just thought it was funny that the, like, the, the fence kind of like bounced away. <laughs> and here we have the Wonder Twins. How cyborg sorry, do you think I, they I are? Said, I said that joke, uh, I was trying to set that joke up to be timed better, but yeah. I was going to say form of... Wait, Dead dude, guy. is that Metal one. Gear? Metal Gear. Okay, Metal we Gear. Got that out of the way. No, no more of that. No more of that. But yeah, the game is gonna go ahead and throw a fucking Metal Gear at you in the prologue. And yeah, he's gonna have to fight that. What a wreck it. Yes, he's gonna beat the ever-loving shit out of it without even really trying. I'm wreck it, Ralph. I'm gonna wreck it. You're not gonna wreck it. I'm gonna wreck it with my face. Oh Careful, shit! Busy might sue us. So that's Sundowner. Everybody say hi, Sundowner. Gotta hate Sundowner. I love Sundowner. He has the best theme in the game, but we'll get to that when we get to that. And also, uh, yeah, he has a giant pair of scissors. And he will scissor your head off. That's kind of what he does. That's why he's called Sundowner. I know that doesn't make any sense, but it does in my head, and that's the important thing. Boom. So now he's going to kidnap Nelson Mandela. He's mine now. Yes. He always Stop. wanted his own Nelson Mandela clone. Stop! That's just... That, that's the whole goal of this game is to stop him from kidnapping Nelson Mandela clones. Yeah, I, th they're all over so the place, Jack. you know, in this bleak, desolate, cyborg future. <laughs> I want him dead. I want him dead. <laughs> Nothing personal. He wants course. to pin him to his wall like a butterfly. Africa's just getting a bit too peaceful. 
Oh yeah, so here we go with uh, blah 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 Kojima, blah 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 war economy, blah 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 sons of the Patriots, blah blah blah. I don't really understand how politics works, but this sounds all philosophical and shit, so we're gonna run with it. Yeah, pretty much. It's your basic Kojima plot, despite the fact that Kojima honestly had very little to do with this game. Don't worry now. He pretty much handed the reigns over to Platinum completely and said, hey, Not while he's still. make this useful. game, yeah, at least make it's true it Metal Gear. At least it's true to the source material, though. So oh, long. yeah, it really is. Unfortunately, I read somewhere that Kojima doesn't consider it canon, even though he absolutely loves it. So, if Metal Gear Solid 6 comes out ever, uh, it'll probably ignore this. How can right, it so yeah, like time that. to fight Metal Gear. Does it have vocals? Does it have lungs? They have a metal gear? It has a sound. Or is this a big fucking speaker? Yeah, exactly. But chop your leg up, bitch! Oh, oh shit. Oh, I thought he was gonna step on me. Try and cut his tail off if you can. Oh, you can cut the tail off? Oh, uh, you have to you have to parry it perfect. You have to get a perfect parry on the tail. I oh, okay. Think. It's a pain in the ass, but there's an achievement for it. So show it off if you can, if you can't whatever. I didn't know you could do that. Yeah, I only knew about it. It doesn't affect anything at all. Oh boy! Oh boy! <laughs> that was close. Now step on you! Step on you! Use blade mode to damage its armor. Use blade mode to damage its armor. Ba ba ba! Chase! This fucking tree! I can't see shit. Hey! 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 What? I'm sorry. That was terrible. What? Here at Monster Party, we're, where we're using outdated memes for fun and profit. <laughs> Except for the profit part. Da -da 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 -da. And the fun part, really. Da -da 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 -da. None of that noise. So when you ninja run, you block bullets. And oh god, we can't block, block lasers! Giant lasers. You can't block the giant lasers with your sword. Oh boy. And you're just gonna go ahead and get hit by that one. No? Oh wow, you dodged it. Yeah, awesome. I got away. Yeah, you got some bad ninja skills there, base. I haven't gotten hit once, because I'm a boss. You're at 99% health, you've gotten hit once. No, I didn't. That's just yeah, max health I didn't. Oh, no. shit! Well, either way, you got stepped on, so... Yeah, so much for those mad skills, bro. Come here, I want to break your leg! There we go. You can't break his leg. He's gonna cut off his gun. See? Just slice the crap out of him. Yeah! Ninja! Playbook! The cool thing about the, uh... The PC version is that you can increase the uh, Zengeki and Zan time. I have it on the lowest setting right now because whoa, I'm whoa, 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 that's, that's some anime words right there. Use English. Well, okay, so the cut and stuff, you can cut more. There you go. You can, yeah. I have to dumb it down for you next, is that it? You have to dumb it down for our audience who aren't gamers. <laughs> I'm sure they're weeaboo enough, come on. Oh, but some of them, sure. We want Don't underestimate the power of the internet. Weeaboo's alike. Da, 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 da. Oh shit! Take all kinds. No, stop, 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 stop! Move! No, get, get your sword out of your pumps and run. You can't, you can't run when you got the sword pumps. It's worth it though to make his ass look good. Yep. Digga, digga, digga. Also, how about this? Yeah. Job, job. This game uh, has some. Fucking fantastic, too. Yeah. Oh, I think the lyrics just kicked in. Wait, what kicked in? Oh, oh yeah. The lyrics, oh, yeah. Hey. Yeah, the boss fights especially in this game. They have uh, every boss fight song has uh, instrumental mode and lyric mode. Once you start getting them down. Uh, Give me your head. I want your head. Up. Yeah, I gotcha. So as you can see, Platinum went to some great lengths to make Ryden incredibly badass in this. And I like to think they succeeded. Like I said, I always thought Ryden Oh crap! Through. Yeah, see that? You could have blocked and then cut off his tail. Oh. No, no, wait. No. Block it! Why don't you, you block it? Again. You might go around again. Let's see. Come on, do it. Do it, you wuss. Oh crap. No. Just Listen to the Russian guy. He knows what he's talking about. Despite being Russian. I want to cut the tail. 
Ah, oh, fuck it, I'll just, I'll just, just finish kill him. him. Just yeah, kill him. Yeah, finish him. You got a time limit here. Sorry. YouTube won't let us upload oh, videos I can't kill him. two hours. I have to kill him this way. That's his rest style. Uh, what style? Wait, you can't kill him until you do a splashy move. A finish yeah. move. Run up and hit him, and it'll give me the option. Yeah, let's do this. Yeah. Yeah, we got, this game has sort of cute keys, which is the only real problem I have with it. I mean, they're not as bad as a lot of games, but I mean, I don't know why they keep putting these in. I don't. Do they think people like it? And yeah, yeah. Here we're gonna just go ahead and throw a Metal Gear. Yes, yes. Suplex that motherfucker. Open. Split it wide open! Hey, when a Russian man tells me to split it wide open, I just gotta do it. That, when any man tells you to split it wide open, you just feel like you gotta do it. So that's the prologue, boss. Horosho, very good! But do Horosho, not oh, that's right. Yet, huh? This game tosses Russian in here. And yeah, you tend to get graded on all the big fights. Well, I really got they a C. Suck, so yeah, they suck, so we got to see. Well, that blows. I mean, you can't really get combos, kills, or anything in there, so it's all based on time, and you, you did take your sweet ass time. I did take my sweet ass time. All right. Uh, uh, how long have we been going now? That was like, that was a five-minute fight right there. Well, that was a five-minute fight, but how long has the video been going? I don't know. It doesn't keep track. It doesn't keep track? No. Really? All right, well... Uh, honestly, I think this is probably a pretty good place to end the first video, so uh, thanks for watching, everybody. I have no clue where I'm going anyway, so. Fair uh, enough. Just saved, so yeah. Alright, peace. All right.